Yo guys, it's your boy Cabal here, and we're gonna be doing another dedicated subscriber. So you know the deal. We got the people right here, and also got another question for you guys. Do you still want me to do the dedicated subscriber series? Um, there's only one person that I know that hates it, and that's a formal teammate of uh, Flight Gaming, which is Vanilla. So yeah, sorry for shouting you out though, but <laughs> but yeah, he's been. Um, some people have been t saying that it's good to have dedicated subscribers, but it's kind of annoying when it's the same exact people. I mean, but I just want to shout out my subscribers, that's pretty much it. So I want you guys to comment down below if you still want me to continue with the series. And of course I'm not going to get any comments of that because usually when I say a question, there's no one going to answer me. So yeah, that's something I want to say and I just had a crazy day. I'm literally, I literally just got home. Today is Wednesday, I literally just got home. Um, we just, um, my dad just came back home from a Harley dealership. And we just bought a 2005 Sportster, if anyone knows what Go motorcycles are. What? Wait, what, Christopher? Go I don't really care. All I know is 2005. Okay, it's a 2005, mo 2005 model motorcycle, it's whatever. 2005 I don't give a shit, Christopher! Alright, so as I was saying, we got, we got a motorcycle. Let's just say it like that. We got a motorcycle, and we now it's in the financing. We've gone through all that, and it's getting delivered as we speak. Uh, we don't know when's it going to get delivered. All know though, all we know is it's just they're about to deliver it, and I'm going to tell you the process that we have to went through. We went inside. We talked to a bald man. His name is Jeff. So we were talking to Jeff about the financing and on uh, the two motorcycles that we we're about to get. It was a 2005, a, a 1200 Sportster, and the other one was a 2012, whatever the fuck it was. So we checked both of those motorcycles. The first one we saw was um, the 2012 that was in front of the, in front of the in front of the whole entire building. And then we also saw the 1200 2005 Schwarzer, which was in the back of the employees only section. So at first, uh, first we seen it, my dad liked it, he, but he had like a hard time with like the, the pedals, I guess. And then in the back, um, um, there's also some problems with um, the foot pegs. There was not any foot pegs, but they were about to install it because right now, as according to law, you have to have foot pegs in to I don't know, to be safe, I guess, or something like that. I'm not an expert on this. But, so, they're installing it right now. They've already been installed. Well, they, no, they weren't. Yeah, they were. I said they're going to be installed. Well, I, well they did it. Like, I'm trying to do a video here. All right. As I was saying. So, we got, so they got the foot pe and the pegs, like, installed on, and then we also bought uh, something called a sissy, like, what is it called? A sissy what? It's called a, it's called a sissy bar, but it's a backrest. A sissy bar, a sissy bar, and what's basically what that is, and th that is a backrest, to, so that my uh, Christopher can lean on to the motorcycle. Uh, since it, uh, by law, you have to have pretty much, so pretty much, my brother is the expert on motorcycles. I'm not it at all, so yeah. So yeah, if you hear something annoying from him, then yeah, there you go ahead. But anyway, we got all that, went through all the paperwork, been through the finance, and my dad, as soon as he bought the motorcycle with all this money he got. And some of the money that he, I had to pay him, he was a nervous breakdown. He felt like he was about to like jump off the bridges that was near Houston. <laughs> he was like a nervous wreck when he bought the motorcycle. But all he knows is that uh, he's a religious person. He he believes in God and blah blah blah. So he thinks this was like a good deal for him. He prayed for God that he he got the motorcycle. It was the best deal that he ever saw. And all of his life, his. His plan was to get a Harley. That's what he wanted to get. He wanted to get it a Harley Davidson registered motorcycle. And he finally did. He finally accomplished what he wanted. He said that God led him to the motorcycle and it did. He got he got a 2005 uh, 1200 Sportster. So and there was also some stuff that also happened while we were getting the car like um let's say um uh, when we went to dinner, when we went to lunch. We had McDonald's of course. We're fat asses over here and we stumbled upon this black gentleman that wanted to draw us. Like, I think he was in the caricatures or something like that, but he wanted to draw us, and my dad wanted to help him out, to help him, like, support his family, probably give him some dinner or something like that. So, um, my dad told me, do you have $20? And I said, yeah. And what... So, I gave him the $20, and he drew the both of us. And it was an amazing picture. Um, I don't know where the picture is. Um, Christopher, do you know where the picture is? Well, I can't show you the picture right now. Do I have it? All right, so dad has my dad has the picture, but if I can find the picture somewhere, I can probably show you guys what the picture actually looks like. So yeah, the, we had a kind of a crazy, crazy day, and the funny, the funny about that is that the deal. Oh, you found it? Could you bring it over here? 
So yeah, we gotta have a crazy night and um, well, crazy day on just just for a motorcycle. But I always loved Houston. I always loved like the, the people over there and how good it was. Okay, here is um, the both of us, and this is what the guy draws for 20 bucks. He wanted us to, to draw the both of us so that he can actually make some money because it makes him cold hard cash. And then uh, this is what we got into. So yeah, we got a good drawing from the, from the black dude at McDonald's. Who knew? But yeah, that's just our crazy day on... Uh, this is literally what happened a few hours ago. That's a crazy day we also had. And I'm guessing that's a, that should wrap it up for this, uh, for this amazing and crazy day in Houston. If you like this commentary in this video, please subscribe. Leave a like. Who shows me a lot of support? Check in the links in the description below. Let's see if I can get this last guy over here. Oh, I didn't no, even grab the guy. Fisher, she get the fuck out. No, I'll, I'll get a kill. Watch. I'll do it. Alright, get a kill right now. I got you. Get a kill right now. Okay. Right, you, you can only get one chance. You gotta get one kill. No, I don't know. That one did not count. Okay. What do you mean? Let's sit. Let me sit on my lap? Yeah. You're sitting on my horse. Alright, let's see if you can get the guy. Oh my gosh, I can't play. This is really hard. Well, you're on control freak, that's why. Just, I'm on control, I don't play. Okay, I'm gonna get a kill, what's gonna happen? Alright, go get a kill. Give me some cramps again, I remember these. Wrecked. Now, get, now let's see how many can you get while you're cutting off the circulation on my arm. Alright, give me that. Got a kill, I did it. So yeah, um, I'm guessing that's pretty much it. Until then, ball out.